Back, 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 back,
How do you feel about Clement Lassiter? George Carolyn, can you move something for us? Oh, he did kill the school teacher named Clement. Well, wasn't it that his wife? Clement wasn't his wife. That was the man that she was missing around, supposedly. Mr. Warren was the one that was killed when Mr. Carolyn, Carolyn received the guilty verdict. He's the one that got up and shot the lead prosecutor, Mr. Warren, Mr. in the Warren. chest. In the chest. Mm -hmm. Before he killed himself because he stood here in front of the judge. Stood here in front of the judge and killed Mr. Warren, the lead prosecutor. Can you say something for us? Don't be shy. I know what happened to you happened many, many, many years ago. But, you know, you can speak and you don't have to worry about any judgment now. It's been a long time. Picking up the recorder. I think that I'm going to climb up those steps. Just set the recorder back down. I think what steps? I might climb up those steps. I think there's a block up there just to see what's up there. I wouldn't. They went up there. I don't think anyway. No, it looks like some kind of attic, but it's kind of blocked off. George Lasseter, if you're here, you better let us, I mean, God knows, I'm sorry. George Carolyn, if you're here, you better let us know. Knock on something. Do this. Let us know you're here, because we're going to leave soon, and we're probably not never going to come back. We got to hear you knock. Remove something. What was that? I thought I heard a whisper. I thought I did too, but I don't know. I thought you did too? Mr. Warren, is that you? I don't think it's not that keeps coming from over there. Maybe we need to turn the box back on. George Carolyn. I just think I've seen an orb. See? I just seen, I don't know if it was dust or an orb or what.
George Carowin, can you hear me? Mr. Carowin, if you're here, do you have fun having this whole place up here to yourself? Hmm. Or is there somebody here that keeps you company at night time? Like Mr. Warren, or is it just you? It's weird how they quit doing it and then start talking, they do it again. Mm -hmm. Are you being tormented, tormented day and night? Is something holding you here? Is there anything that we can do to help you out in some way if you are here? Which I think the jailhouse was, was next door, right? Mm -hmm. I think it was. I, I'm pretty it sure. Was. Didn't they used to have like gallows over there too? Before they moved everything across the street. Across the road. <laughs> With the jailhouse under the court house. There's the jailhouse. George Carroll, how old are you now? Can you tell me how old you are? I won't hear it for the trial. Man, I wish I could have been. What was it? One of the largest trials before Lizzie Borden's trial? After Lizzie Borden. After Borden's. Lizzie Borden's trial. I thought it was before. No, it was after. Like the largest in the nation after Lizzie Borden? Yeah. Let me just went to read. Can you light them devices up all the way to red for me? Did you hear that? Yeah. Was that you, George Carolyn? What about the prosecutor? Mr. Warren. Mr. Warren, are you here? Is there anything that you would like to say, Mr. Warren, if you're still with us? Can you tell us anything? Is there any word that you would like to tell us from where you are right now? Anything. Any word. Is there a message from the other side? Can you change the temperature? Just sat down with the thermometer. I mean the temperature probe. Moving recorder right now, setting it back down on the table. Is there anything that you can tell us? What was your wife's name, Mr. Carroll?
Mr. Warren, what was your wife's name? My wife's name is Carrie. She's right here. Now we kind of know each other. <laughs> What was that? Huh? Uh, thought I heard something. Some kind of water or something. Thought I heard some, something like water running. Can you make that noise for us again? Sound like walking? Sound like what now? To me, it sounds like something was coming down that ladder. I know, that's what it sounded like to me, too. Is there somebody coming down that ladder? Sound like somebody was walking, though. No joke. Who's with us right now? I don't believe in ghosts. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you that right now. Y'all haven't showed anything to me that you're real. don't scare me. I'm not afraid. No matter what you are. Because I have my God beside me. Always. It does sound like walking a little bit up there, don't it? I do keep hearing something over there, though. Is anybody sitting in the pews? Hear ye, hear ye, hear ye. What was the judge's name? The, the Honorable Judge Brinkley presiding. Would you like me to Preside over your case. Can you change the temperature for me? Drop that temperature down to 65. I do feel like it is cooler over here. No, seriously, it feels like it's cooler over here. But it really, I don't think it is. 68, 68, 67, 67. Is anybody sitting in the pews? What was that noise? You just cough?
Mr. Carolyn, if you can, can you show yourself, show yourself to us? We would like to take your picture. We're getting ready to leave here in a second. Mr. Warren, can we take your picture also, please? We'd sure appreciate it, both of you. Mr. Carolyn, Mr. Warren, we're getting ready to leave. We appreciate you taking your time with us. And uh, we did hear your voice. Like I said, we might be able to hear you on the recorder, and I just picked it up, sent it back down. If we did hear you, we might come back. If not, tell us to not come back. Just let us know. Say, hey, don't come back or okay. do come back or do come back make it clear as possible okay let us know say hey come back or hey don't come back you know i mean we got to hear your voice clearly okay but just tell us in this little device right here Come put your mouth up to it or whatever. Speak in it. Whoever is here. And also tell us your name if you're here also. But anyway, we're about to leave. And we appreciate any of the information that you may have provided to us. And uh, thank you. Anyway, people, please like and subscribe to our channel. If you will, we sure do appreciate it. We really need it. And hit that bell notification. Yeah, that way you get all of our updated videos as soon as we come out with them. We're trying to release new videos weekly, but we might not be every week right to begin with, but we- It depends on the weather. Depends on the weather and whether we have a location to actually to investigate. So what we're trying and shooting for weekly right now. All right, man, thank you. And don't forget to, to uh, subscribe to us. The, the Bath Paranormal Investigation Team
to go in. It's just the other door. Back from the dead.